Hello everyone, it's uh, Rad. Uh, welcome to my channel Rad Kutarot and uh, this is going to be a disclaimer that needs to stand in front of every video I do. So if you this is the first time you are here, welcome. If not, and should you wish to proceed, well, you can fast forward into the reading that it is ahead of this disclaimer. But as a disclaimer, I need to advise you that this is a, a general reading um, of the representative star sign and for that reason because tarot is very personal divination tool and does require narrative which in personal readings appear to be your question or the situation that you are describing uh, the read the general reading may or may not resonate entirely with uh, with your situation and if it resonates that great if it doesn't i do apologize for that but sh i'm yeah, and I wish you the best, you know, with some, with the situation that you're trying to cope with. But um, if you wish to proceed with the um, personal readings or uh, you wish to follow me on Facebook or on YouTube, you know, all, all of that or visit my website, all of that is going to be written in the description the box down below. And uh, thank you for watching in advance and uh, now lay back and uh, enjoy the video. All right, so this is going to be a Libra Sun, Libra Moon, and as well Libra Rising. Weekly Tarot reading September 23rd to September 29th, a 2019. And just bear with me a couple of seconds, guys, to shuffle the Tarot cards, and uh, we can jump right into it. Alright, so the first card which stands for the topic of your week Libra is going to be the Nine of Cups, followed by the next one which represents the challenges uh, that you need to overcome here throughout the week, that is going to be the Ace of Pentacles, then the third card which represents the, uh, the positive aspect of the week, that is going to be the Knights of Pentacles, and then the last, uh, the last one which represents the uh, guidance that Tsar is offering to you. We do have the Four of Cups, uh, the Four of uh, Wands, excuse me. So it's uh, quite of an exciting week what we do have. But before we go into that, let's uh, run the cards one more time. So Nine of Cups, it is uh, the uh, topic of the week, followed by the next one, which stands for the uh, challenges that you need to overcome. That is going to be the Ace of Pentacles. Then we do have the, the uh, Knights of Pentacles, which stands for the positive aspect. And then the last one uh, here, it is the Four of Wands, which rep represents the guidance the Tarot is offering. So the topic itself, it is the Nine of Cups, and it is catalyzed or accompanied by the Magician. And uh, the, the combination, first of all, it is a, a passive neutrals, and uh, you are gonna feel a bit awkward throughout this uh, week it is uh, because how do i say it uh, the enterprise that is to happen to you throughout the week is not going to be unpleasant but it's going to be different that that that's the whole point and you may feel a bit unprepared for it all right you may not know how to act you may not know how to how to take on the things in there but what you need to know here is that whatever enterprise it is to arise for you throughout the week either with the person you like or you love or in your job or etc etc yeah, uh, how do I say it? You, you need to indulge with it or rather like you need to focus on it because it will offer you or rather like it will present you with either a, uh, a growth or either a happiness, but it will be a short term one unless you don't need the net, you don't do the necessary actions to transform it into a, a long lasting one. So someone wants to date with you, well, then just go out and date and even aim for something more than just dating. You know, someone offers you a job, take on the damn job, okay? And try, start performing in there like there is no tomorrow. Although you may not feel like you are on the right place right now, you may feel, like I said, it's a bit awkward that you may not have that, that sovereignty that you usually have, right? And uh, 
that you may not find the determinations in behind your actions that is that is because your expectations lies in a different uh, in a different direction but those expectations can and should be changed when it comes to uh when it comes to the future or rather like you should align your expectations with the uh enterprise at hand okay sometimes one should work with one one with what one has instead of daydreaming for a different uh, for a different means how do you say it in English sometimes you gotta take what what is offered to you or yeah it, it, it goes like that sometimes you gotta take what it is in front of you and just work work with it or work around it or you, or, or you name it and uh, the next card here which uh, represents the challenges is going to be the ace of Pentacles. And the accompanied card, it is the Six of Wands. Uh, the formation, it is a passive neutrals once again. And uh, it does look like here, it is that you may find it difficult to believe that that thing has a, uh, has a future. That, that's the whole point, that this enterprise has a future. Why? It is because you, may not, you are not going to um, see straight away you know where the milestones are all right where uh, what the success is going to look like uh, into this career or into this relationship if you want to say it that way so what well, my point here is that this enterprise that appears to you throughout the week you are going to take it in the wrong way at least initially and you will not be able to see that that is actually a good opportunity for you to be lucrative to be uh, to be happy to be filled of content all right and uh, in generally to establish either a harmoniously flowing relationship or a uh, um, to improve that relationship, you know, or to be successful in the business that is approaching you. But um, nonetheless, this old thing is going to manifest through some sort of a um, help that it will be offered to you. And in this case, there is no reason should or, or need for you to reject the help that it is offered to you. I help the help could manifest in many, many different cases. But the thing is that all starts from a an offer for a helping hand. And once you take that hand, it seems that the things is going to slow uh, snowball afterwards. And you should take your time, just like I said, you know, to consolidate on them to to secure what have been uh, what, what have been accomplished thus far. So take one thing at the time that is very, very important. Then the next card that we do have for you, Libra, is going to be the positive aspect, and that will be the Knights of Pentacles, and it is the helping hand that comes around. The Knights of Pentacles, it is um, catalyzed here with uh, the uh, Four of Cups. So that is a person who achieved, for the most part, his goals in life, and that is a well mature kind of individual and what i mean is that that's someone who really knows what they what they want and how to get it as well they are never frantic and in the same time they um how do i say it they are kind of methodical and quite calculative and very patient and calm but in the same time their actions are strongly supported by a solid determinations behind that is usually a person who loves to spend time among nature so if you are to set up a date with them do not get surprised if that date is in the park you know or on a, or on a hike and so on and so forth so what's the whole deal here well like i said this person here almost achieved everything that they have wanted to except from one thing you okay so that that's the whole point and uh, they see new tremendous potential either for business or either in the relationship and this week it is where they are going to try to give it a go are they going to do it at all cost no so if you give them rough time they're going to simply you know abandon the idea and move to something different but what they what that person thinks or rather like how they how that person what standpoint that person takes throughout this week is that they need something refreshing they need something new and you are the newness okay and they will simply try to get close to you by offering you help because that's the best way how you can get close into someone
okay you just offer a help and if they take the help that means that you're gonna get that you are gonna spend time together and as well that the person who offers help is gonna learn something for the life of the other and the last card that we do have it is the guidance that Tara is offering and that is the four of cups accompanied with the page uh, the four of wands I don't know why I'm saying the four of cups always but the pay the uh, four of wands with the page of cups <clears throat> So here the formation, it is a active enemies that we do have and um, uh, it's a bit uh, difficult combination to be described. So um, first of all, I, I will start one thing, uh, one thing at the time. First of all, it isn't about a, a celluloid expectations here. What I mean is that you should maintain your sense of practice, uh, of, of practice practical expectations or rather like practical development that it is to move forward additionally to that there are a lot of a uh, minor details that needs to be attended before you can actually close the cycle with this person and under closing the cycle it is like closing the deal accepting the job um, um, establishing a relationship dating and so on and so forth uh, and also these two cards are uh, asking you not to change in any way i mean why that person approaches you because they like what they see okay you don't have to change in any way because then you may prove yourself something that they do not like and then that is a certain way how you can um, um, how you can lose that opportunity so what i'm trying to say here guys is that if you are single for example okay and you start getting close to somebody throughout this week uh, do not align yourself with their interests all right do not try to uh make yourself more likable for them by going out of your way just be who you are i don't don't, don't uh, adopt a different positions than your current positions because uh, this knights of pentacles they pretty much made their homework about you and they very well know what they are dealing with they very well know what they are facing and they are willing to uh, to work it out so it's a, a jump into um into in, into a quite of a good cooperation a cooperation which is going to seal uh, a certain aspect of your life and will allow you to grow into the next one so that being said uh libra this was your weekly tarot reading guys for a september 23rd to september 29th 2019 i hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and we are going to see each other next time until then bye